know what direction the wind is blowing in, okay? So if the wind is blowing this way, it's going to spin it this way. If the wind is blowing that way, it's going to spin it this way. Okay. This one right here, this is an example of something called a barometer. This one's a little tough. Because what happens is that when the wind blows, say the wind blows, okay? Let's put this one next to this one. Say the wind blows and then it's blowing this way, blowing this way. What's going to happen is that the air in the sky is going gonna, gonna to build pressure. Okay, it's going to build a lot of pressure. And say, for example, let's say if somebody <laughs> is sitting on top of you, like somebody's sitting on your stomach, right? It's like, oh my God, I, I feel a lot of pressure. That's exactly what the wind does to the atmosphere. It builds pressure, and this measures that type of pressure. Okay, so that's what happens. That's the barometer. This right here is called an anemometer. It's very fancy. That's a fancy. Okay. And you guys see how this one's colored red and the other ones are not? Um, meteorologists use this to, to uh, measure the, the speed of the wind. So let's say the wind is blowing really slowly. It's going to go really slow, really slow, right? 